the monsters. Who are your favorite monster villains? Mine has to be Cybermen. I uh, prefer Cybermen over um, Daleks. Okay. Myself. Okay. I'll have to interrupt you and say my favorite Cybermen scene of the first of the new series is I believe it was in the final two parter of the Tenant first season where they play is it tainted love and you start seeing the saws come down and the parts flying yeah. <laughs> i was like oh that's amazing that's great oh, music we could talk about music too but anyway go ahead that cybermen are your favorite cybermen um i always like omega from the classic series oh my god I, I, say, really oh my god. I say oh, oh my god. god i say oh my god Oh my god. I, I really wish he would return. Yeah, there was a lot of theories that he was going to return this, this last Capaldi series. I think he's going to be in Capaldi's last season, though. Okay. That's what I feel like. Because I don't, I don't think Moffat's going to rate him. Oh, yeah, like, that's right. They're getting a new producer. Yeah. I feel like Chibnall would do it. Because Chibnall is really great at keeping secrets. Yeah. Yeah. And I like Gatiss. I really like his episodes. <laughs> Um, he's a monster man. I mean, uh, I don't know if you saw, I think it was a four part series he did on the classic monster movies, uh, like Frankenstein, Dracula. It was a BBC special mini series and Gatiss knows his monsters. And I find a lot of his doctor who stories really entertaining. So, um, and I know he's sticking around. At least there's a, a rumor of him being a co-producer or something. Uh, my favorite monsters. Um, gosh, why are their names dropping from me now? The fish guys. The big red that they brought out. What? Sea devils or, um, or uh, what are they called? The, the, they replicate humans. They're in yeah. a lot of the new episodes. Zygons. Zygons. Sea I, Devils. I love the Zygons. Well, that was the episode, wasn't it? I think it was called Sea Devils. No, that, that's a that's a third. Oh, Terror story. of the Zygons. Terror, Terror of the Zygons. Yeah, like I said, I know who, but um, my mind yeah. is gone. Um, yeah, I, I I love the idea of the Zygons. Uh, I also love the Silurians. I don't know if i like the new silurians although i do like the 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 the, the couple the female oh, the, the couple. Nostra gang yeah with, uh, with the suntaran uh, yeah with with strax yeah i i i do like them i if you know if you're gonna do a torchwood spin-off why isn't there a spin-off of those three characters in old London, just, you know. Um, just some good investigative. Yeah, yeah, you know. Um, the Centaurans. The first time I saw the Centaurans in the Tom Baker episode, uh, the two-parter that came, I believe, after the Ark in Space, um, that scared the hell out of me. When he takes the helmet. No, 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 it was in a Pertwee episode. I, it was before I saw the Pertwee episode uh, with Sarah Jane. But in the Tom Baker episode, the two-parter, which he broke his leg or hurt his leg, I heard. Um, Tom Baker. Uh, the, when he takes the helmet off, I was like, oh my God, what is that? You know? Now it's like Mr. Potato Head. You know? <laughs> you know? But, and it was cool to see them fight the Cybermen in the David Tennant season i believe one of the david Tennant yeah. seasons um but i, I like, like to see I, i'd like to see another suntaran episode like a full-on yeah a evil suntaran you know it's funny when martha jones jumped on the very first episode of martha jones where they took the hospital when before you saw the rhino aliens and yeah. they just had the helmets I <laughs> thought those were the cy uh, cyber uh, the Suntarans. I thought I was like, oh my god, they're bringing the Suntarans back! Yes, yes. And then they took them off, and they're this whole other character. I was like, what is this? <laughs> and all this is Foco Show, no Ro Yeah, 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 yeah. A good episode. I thought. I thought it was a great episode. 
uh, again, lots of lot, just so many great who stories. I mean, of the new era. I mean, there there's tons of the classic stories that are amazing. You know, that we uh, pyramids of Mars and the talents of Wang Chiang, even the horror of Fang Rock, the uh, the Frankenstein story. Um, Oh, I can't think of that one now. Um, lots of great Pertwee ones. Terror of the Autons. and uh, Tomb of the Cybermen. And so many, so many great Who stories. But um, anyway, talking about uh, evil or, or monsters. Suntarans, uh, Silurians. The original Silurians I liked. With Pertwee, uh, especially with Pertwee. Go ahead. I'm trying to. I'm trying to find one of them. The Silence. That's what I was trying to think of. I. What do you think of those guys? That, I liked them in the first episode. I didn't like them in the second. What do you think of that season, actually, as a whole? I. Is that is that uh, the final season? Please. No, that's his second to last. No, no, no. The final season of Rory and um, what's her name? Amy. Amy with yeah, the it's angels. The final, the final full season. Yeah. It, it, they had like five more episodes after that, and then. Yeah, I um, I didn't like how they went out. Uh. I was very confused with Rory always dying. I always thought that was going to pay off better than it did. Um, yeah, Amy. Amy was so cute. Amy Pond. Wow. Um, I'll, I'll say that season was a little clunky. That season was a little clunky. Um yeah, yeah. Um, and of course, we haven't even once talked about the Daleks. Is that because we're just tired <laughs> of them? <laughs> I, I honestly am. <laughs> I'll be honest. It's like there's they... only so much they can do. and I think their return was great. Um, then you fast forward, I think the Cyberman Dalek episode was great. Yeah. And then after that, you got that Dalek human hybrid. Yeah, thing. I didn't care for that one. No, 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 no. Although, although the 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 last one where where what's her name was inside the Dalek. Oh, that was I, I love that episode. Yeah, that was that was pretty damn decent. I'm gonna make a souffle, souffle. Yeah. Um, yeah, the Daleks. You know, but they gotta keep bringing them back. You know that that's like, a Doctor Who staple. You know it's. But I feel like though there's an aspect where it's like in the contract where they have to be three single seasons. <sighs> yeah. Because like in classic Who, it's not like they're in every single season. In fact, no. Tom Baker only sees them twice. And those stories are good. Yeah. If 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 you want to be honest, I I think the classic Dalek series. Uh, or as stories are are much better than the modern Dalek stories, you know the the World War Two one uh, where the bombers are fighting in outer space and yeah, uh, that's kind of you know. But but the earlier ones, even the ones with Colin Baker and 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 Bruce Davison, Bruce Davison, Bruce. Um, who am I thinking of? Come on, who's the fifth doctor? Peter Davison. Peter Davison. God, Bruce Davison. I'm thinking of Willard. Uh, <laughs> um, X Men. Yeah. But um, yeah, even those stories I thought were better stories. Although, although there was that one scene. Was it in a tenant? Yeah, I think it was in the final. Um, like I said, where they were all driving the TARDIS back, the stolen Earth, where he just, where Davros is just bitching at the Doctor, saying, 
you are the evil person. You are the one that's causing all this death. And I thought that scene was really well done. Um, but yeah, da Daleks, when I see the next time preview and I see Daleks, I'm like, oh, well. Okay. How they introduced the new companion, Bill. Oh, with, with that the short, with the Daleks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, I don't know why everybody likes her from that. Because I'm sitting here like, you've got the most evil creature, and she's just ridiculing it. Yeah, I felt but like you know, do you, think, do you think they did that just to, for the new audiences that think, Maybe. like us, that think they're yeah. tired? It's like, he's got a plunger. What What's the plunger going to do? You know, it, it's... I, I think it would have been funnier with like Zygons because they're recent or they come back. Well, like uh, Zygons. Like, why is so scary? Let's get the scary uh, Silurians. Although I thought there's like a peace treaty with them, maybe. Uh, yeah. Let's let's bring. Uh, I don't want to see the angels again. I don't want to see the angel. We we've had too many weeping angels. Um, I want to see the Centaurans or or the. Um, yeah, the Centaurans, evil again. Um, what about, what do you think of the Ood? Oh my God. The Ood, I think they played their course because they led up to the Doctor's regeneration. You know, and I, yeah. don't, I don't know if they need to come back. Their final appearance at the end of the specials, I think, was good enough. Oh, dude. Did you cry when Tennant and Rose were separated between the wall? The first time I did. <laughs> and the second time, the third time, and fourth time, I was like, throw a wall. Oh, really? See, I haven't gotten there yet. I've only seen it once, and it got me. So I'm, I'm getting, I'm going to be well, watching just that. First, the first time I did, it was just because I was a little less inexperienced of the Doctor Who universe. And now I, and now I see Capaldi, and I'm like, he'd just be like, "F off." Yeah. Be gone. I got, I got stuff to do. I'm gonna go chill with Clara. She's not that lying. Were you excited when you when you were watching Who, and you saw the next time trailer, and you saw Rose was coming back with that big ass gun? Yes. Yeah. That was tough. <laughs> it was like, oh fuck, this is gonna be great. How is she back? In, in the episode Turn Left, where it's that alternate yes. universe. Yeah, if, with the bug on the back. The, yeah. I, I always get a chill when I see Rose during that. Yeah. I just get goosebumps. Like, yeah. oh my gosh, you can feel something bad's about to happen. Yeah. yeah. 